Hello all, welcome back. This is part six, actually, and I was hoping to be further along by part five, but uh, anyway, um, I want to start doing a little bit of tweaking on this before we start adding our hands and feet. You know, we got to add our nipples and things like that to our model. So let's go ahead and just tap into edit mode, and it's right off the bat. That crotch looks like it's a little bit low. So. Let's go in here and I'll you know, start here. Let's grab these and these. Let's grab the next group up as well. And let's pull those up on Z. It's a little bit better. Now let's undo that. Let's grab these two. Let's pull those up on Z. Right about there. Pull those up just a little bit. Okay. Pull those up a little. Okay. Start leading this into the back of the behind a little bit. Take those down. that one up. Okay. I think that'll be alright. Just kind of round this stuff out a little bit better. Let's go to the front. And that's not really working out. Now let's go to the front. <laughs> Just pull that down a little bit more. Just kind of work it out get a little bit better shape. Okay. So we should probably work out the back as well. <laughs> so let's pull that up on Z a little bit. Take that one up a little bit more. Take that up actually quite a bit, so let's pull those up a little. And maybe, maybe take those in a little bit on X. And just kind of manipulate these a little bit better. Let's pull that one in on Y. this one too. Okay. Yeah, that looks a whole lot better to me. <coughs> Excuse me. All right. And I think I need to take some of these out a little bit. On X. And in retrospect, we probably need to take these in for the uh, abdomen. And these we can kind of adjust in. See how that looks. Quite a bit better. It's a little bit, a little bit tight. Let's take these down a little bit. Okay. And looks like I want to add a division across both of these. Start with this one. 
screw that selection up and smooth it once real quick. Okay, and let's take these. Actually, let's just take these two and pull them out along Y a little bit. Yep, it's a little bit better. Let's try just taking this one out. Okay. And let's add another division right here. And I don't want to do too much smoothing right there. But I don't want to smooth the rest of them a little bit. So control plus. Let's remove that one again. And we'll just smooth it twice. Okay. And we'll take these and pull them out very slightly. So hold down shift on or pull them out on Y. There we go. Much better. So now we have a pretty well defined ab area. Also help to uh, define those hips a little bit better. Let's just pull this one out a little bit. Okay. Go to the front and adjust these. And that seems like there's a little bit of a bulge right there from the front. Yeah, you can see it. So, um, I can actually do it one of two ways. I can take this part out. Let's see if we can take it back, actually. I know I want to try and take that one back. And that was a mistake, so I'll undo both of those. Whoops. Redo that. I'm just going to try and smooth them. Not too bad. I'm going to smooth that. And let's just uh, Alt S to swell using the shift button to pull them out a little. Okay, that looks a little bit better. Let's try that again. Okay. We need to work that out now. Interpolate those as much as possible. Okay. <clears throat> this 
still just not getting what I want here. That's a little bit better. Okay. Pretty much got rid of that. But now this part's a little bit too much, so just grow that selection. Smooth it once. Yeah, that seems okay. And these abs right here. Let's just grab these that we pulled in. And let's grow that selection. And smooth it once. A lot better. We could smooth it again. Okay, I'm fine with that. But we need to kind of fix it up too. So let's grab moves, take those down and around. I actually want to pull them down a little bit further. Maybe pull this one up a little bit. Okay, that might be a little bit too much. Let's go to the side. Let's grab and move that. Let's take it up. Okay. And let's take these up just straight up. Okay. <coughs> Excuse me. These three I'm going to smooth. Alright, that's better. So now, let's tap back into edit mode. And I want to put a belly button in here. I'm going to do it. No, you can't stop me. But I don't want to um, um, add a lot of geometry everywhere else. I'm going to see what happens if we just extrude that. Okay, let's scale it down a little bit. Let's go ahead. Whoops. Go to edges, there we go. I'm going to smooth that twice. And I'm going to grab these. Whoops, right there. Let's pull them in just a little bit on Y, so hold down Shift. There we go. Okay. And you go back to faces. Let's extrude those. Okay. Let's scale those down. And pull them in on Y, holding Shift. And also on Z. We don't need to hold shift for that. Okay, it looks alright. It needs to be smooth though, so let's grow that up. And smooth that. Much, much better. Oops. Pulls back again on Y. Let's uh, rotate that a little bit on X. And let's go into vertices. I'm going to take these up on Z. Okay. Let's go to the front. I want to pull those in a little bit. Okay. And um, we could extrude this a couple more times going uh, in 